And the same thing I found interesting was the amount of people who I would rarely see give a a black rapper any kind of credence or kudos for uh, something they have done, you know, some potentially white supremacist adjacent type folks are, are uh, you know, maybe not all that bad. You know, finding a, a special space or place to to raise Kanye up for us and and talk about how what a great man he is and how he's going to change lives, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. I find that interesting, and that also made me a little curious as to why Kanye and why now, you know. Um, then I got to thinking about it. Well. Um, I'm sure people are happy about Kanye and his Jesus, but I also think some people are happy about Kanye and his politics. Um, and I think we can compartmentalize the two. There's the imperfect man who who knows Jesus and is trying to do all the things they believe to be right. Um, and there's that walk with Christ that is everyone's own walk, right? And in parallel to that walk is some things that may just be your flesh, um, and whatever else may be motivating you, whether it be finances, being liked, money, mental state, whatever the case might be. You know, all of these things are kind of moving together. And uh, while I believe God cares about them all, you know, I, I also believe God kind of works on us kind of in part. One, th one or two things at a time and he continues to, to get us there. And there's some things we just never want to turn over to him. Um, some things we, we, we're willing to and some things we're not. So, so anyhow, um, and yeah, I, I think it's, uh, people are not only raising him up because some of us now, because I took to social media and I definitely gave Kanye some praises. So again, I'm not hating the man. Um, but I do think some of us are raising him up, uh, not necessarily because of his Jesus, but because he's a brother who I could finally tack myself onto, who I feel like has some political ties with me. And I think that's where we have to be careful about what our motivations are. Again, the context here is I believe Kanye is getting a treatment, which I don't have anything against the treatment that he's getting, that the same one of us who are giving him that treatment wouldn't afford everyone else. You know, he wouldn't afford the common everyday working man who didn't have a machine and a bank load of money to kind of advertise and the know-how and the smarts to put the nuances of a story out there so we can buy it and see it at every corner, you know. Everyone doesn't have that luxury. Um, and, and I see that, that contrast. Um, 